Welcome in Red Scout Idle Aircraft Carrier over here on Idle Games TV. You're going to watch the ad, you're going to double up your income, but this is the main idea. You're going to have a lot, a lot of, let's say, missions that you do need to complete because you're going to need to build up a lot, a lot of planes over here. So you're going to have the most important thing is going to be the map. Let's start with that because I forgot about it and you're going to be able to have different kind of fleets over here. Now here it is, if you're going to have enough cash, you're going to be able to move to the next zone, next zone and so on. I have played in the first one so much that I forgot that I would be was able to move next, next, next zone and so on. So you're going to be able to level up up to 25, afterwards you're going to watch an ad, you're going to be able to reset that progress. You're going to be able to watch some ads in order for you to get different kind of skins for your planes over here. As you can see, I have a dragon over here and an alien spaceship. Uh, you're going to have the possibility to watch a lot of ads. You're going to have this lucky spin over here. Every day you can watch up to 10 ads and you're going to get some gemstones from here. Watch this, it's really important. And you're going to be able to go in different kind of fights. Now, depending on the fleet that you're going to be able to have over here, you're going to do different kind of fights as I mentioned. Now, right now I have 21.46 billion power and my enemy has 50.24 billion power. Let's jump into the game. Now, if you do not have enough rubies in order for you to accept the fight, you can watch an ad and that's how you're going to be able to send your fleet into those fights. You do need to do as many upgrades as you can. The main idea would be to reach uh, the battle level 100. Uh, afterwards, you can move to the next fleet in order for you to upgrade it. But if you do have enough cash to unlock the next fleet, unlock it and try to play as there uh, over there as well, because you're going to uh, lose time if you're going to stay in only one fleet. Play on the other fleet as well, because this game you're going to need to watch a lot of ads to get all, all the rewards. And as long as you're going to watch the ads, try to play in two different kind of fleets, two different kind of zones in a way, in order for you to get all, all the benefits. Now, if you have played similar games, drop a comment and let me know. I saw this ad regarding this game and decided to give it a try. An interesting enough game. It does have some pop-up ads. I will tell you that it does have some pop-up ads, but at the end of the fight, like for example, when this fight will end, I will have a pop-up ad because I know I played it as I mentioned. You do need to watch a lot of ads in order for you to double up the income, to get more and more cash, in order for you to be able to do more and more summons. You're going to need to do, uh, in summons I mean, you're going to need to change the skins for the planes. That's what I meant when I meant uh, summon. I do play a lot of idle RPG games, so if you know other idle games or other similar games like this one, drop a comment and let me know. If you're not yet subscribed, please subscribe. If I'm going to hit claim, I'm going to have a pop-up ad. Good idea and a good fact about this game is that those short, short pop-up ads are only maximum 5 seconds. So really good about that part. Now you're going to have different kind of treasures, different kind of suitcases, some gifts over here that you're going to be able to collect and you're going to have the CEO over here. Now if you do have enough of those gemstones, spend them over here in order for you to collect all, all the CEOs and only afterwards, only afterwards try to upgrade them, okay? Afterwards go for the next uh, fleet over here as I mentioned in order for you to unlock it and over here you're going to have the same CEOs that will help you along the way. So you're going to need to unlock all of them and only afterwards upgrade them, okay? Now unlock, unlock as many runways as you can over here, but if you're going to unlock those, you're also going to need to unlock over here the uh, possibility for them to jump into the fight in a way. Reset the progress for that specific uh, uh, plane over there in order for you to increase your profit and that's how you're going to be able to get more cash in order for you to do more upgrades on and on. You're going to have the possibility to do common upgrades over here, common researches in a way, and you're going to do epic researches with the gemstones. Don't bother over here at first. Try to get all the CEOs only afterwards upgrade over here. Try uh, do the, the common ones because those are really important. You're going to be able to have the achievements over here depending on how much did you play and different kind of things that you will be able to unlock. Now you're going to have the missions over here. You're going to play uh, if you're going to play for a specific uh, periods of times so you're going to get more and more gemstones over there and you're going to have this uh, workers over here that you do want to upgrade in order for you to uh, be able to equip your uh, ships your ships your flight your airplanes quite quite fast okay 
Now if you have played this one reach for the drop comment let me know how far you reach. Until next time take care, be safe and don't forget that you can put your money in the game as well Frank you can see over here. Guys don't forget to subscribe. Bye.